Today, November 20th, is the day we celebrate Universal Children's Day. It was established to encourage all countries to institute a day, firstly to promote mutual exchange and understanding among children and secondly to initiate action to benefit and promote the welfare of the world's children. November 20th is an important date as it is the date in 1959 when the UN General Assembly adopted the Declaration of the Rights of the Child. It is also the date in 1989 when the UN General Assembly adopted the Convention on the Rights for the Child. The world is going blue. This UN, the UN rather, has asked individuals, schools and corporates worldwide to go blue to help build a world where every child is in school, safe from harm and can fulfill their potential. Going blue activities include sharing the UN's promo video for Children's Day, signing the global petition and going blue in support of children's rights in social media and much, much more. Representative for UNICEF in the Eastern Caribbean, Dr. Alois Kumarage says while a lot has been accomplished for the protection of children's rights, there is still much to be done. Speaking during the painting of a mural by, the group, by a group of volunteers at the Princess Elizabeth Center in Woodbrook, he noted a significant reduction in children's death under the age of five. Over the last decades, the Caribbean region, as well as the rest of the region all over the world, has had tremendous progress, for instance, in terms of child survival, the reduction of uh, under five mortality rate. We were, the entire world was, world was able to reduce by 60 percent 